of all the houses, but they come to ours. And they really have the whole backyard. This is like the only world that they know. Hi guys. We love it. They've definitely been a joy during quarantine for sure. We come out with our coffee and watch them. We could watch them all day. February, there was a male and a female duck in the pool and I ran out, took pictures, and they flew away. Another time, my husband and I were sitting out in the patio just chatting, and the female flew away. And I go, I didn't even see her there. Did you see her there? And he's like, no. Back you know, the brown and Back in the minute. pool. And I was like, wait a minute. And then I looked back, and there were the eggs, right behind where the pool connects. So I did what anybody would do, and I put a camera over the eggs, because I wanted to watch the eggs hatch. We're dog people. We don't know anything about ducks. It's kind of neat to see her lift up and turn them. She rotates the eggs. A storm came, thunder and lightning, and she's still sitting on the nest. She snaps away a mouth. She'd leave briefly, like once a day to eat, because she would never eat or anything. She would just sit on the nest. One night, it's the first day of spring. I go, I hear peeps, and I look, and I look, and she lifts up, and you see the little babies, and it was so exciting. Their pool is now a pond, and it's, it's there. They can stay as long as they want. <laughs> we feed them three times a day. They get breakfast, lunch, and dinner. They get worms, like, twice a day. They let us know. Yesterday, they were at our bedroom door. They knock on your door when they're hungry. Every morning, they were getting bigger. There we go, guys. I would never in a million years be making it rain worms, let me tell you, <laughs> if it weren't for these guys. And then the mom, this is Daisy, she's always hanging out, always watching them. Kind of a blessing that it happened at the time it did, when it did, during the quarantine time. It's a reminder that, you know, it's not all about you. Life goes on, the simple things in life and the joys of taking care of something else and sharing it with people. They are so cute, so that helps out a lot too. So they're starting to have minds of their own. Eight weeks they're supposed to fly and they're flapping a lot. Oh, oh wow, that was so good, good job. I'm rooting for these guys. Hopefully I can get them flying away soon. It's a hundred degrees out here, so we kind of want our pool back, but I'll be sad when they leave. I have a feeling somebody's going to come back.